All right, um, come back to the other concept. What we're looking at today is volumes of um, solids, and we're looking at cubes and cuboids. So when finding the volumes of cubes and cuboids, we want to make sure that we remember what the formula is. So it's basically a very simple formula where, so the volume is going to equal to multiplying the length um, times the width and we're going to multiply that by the height. So that is how we're going to find it. So basically, we're going to actually capture the the area of the base times the height. So we're going to capture this part. That's the length times the width, and then the height. So basically, we're looking at 6 times 2 times 8. And this is going to give us about 96. Remember though that the the unit for volume is a cube, so it is meter cube. All right, let's take a look at the second one. For number two, what we have is a length of six, the width is five, the height is 10. Volume says that we're gonna multiply the length times the width times the height. So this is going to give us 6 times 5 times 10. And this is going to leave us with 300 millimeter cube. All right. So that's that. Let's take a look at the third one. Length with height. So the volume is going to be Again, length times the width times the height, which is seven times three times six. All right, so 21 times six, this will give us about 126. Remember the unit of measure is centimeter to the third, it's volume. This nine times two times nine. That's going to leave us with a hundred and sixty two millimeter cube. For number five, the moment we already define the length, the width, and the height, then the volume is going to be two times four times six and that is going to leave us with about 48 meter cube the last one here same formula five times three times one and that's going to give us 15 